story is kind of picking up a pace as well. It's interesting to see. Welcome to the final chamber. Final. Don't get overwhelmed. Take everything one step at a time, and you will soon find the solution. There's a lot of stuff in there. And it's fortunate things are nice and numbered. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Is it here? Is it really the final chamber? So it looks like the first thing to do is probably just retrieve the box, which is not hard at all. Yeah. So obviously there's four of these, and there's a temple in the middle. So if I just switch this one to right here. Now there's two options here. It could be like this or it could just be the converse of this. Um, I don't really know. I haven't thought too much ahead. So once I get through here and I get to the time portal, then like what happens next? I have to get number three, which is somewhere. Where's number three? <laughs> I don't actually know where dot three is. Oh, it's right up there. Um, which is, to put it lightly, out of the way. Um, how do I actually hit that one? Let me experiment with this first. Um, am I supposed to hit it at a wacky angle, or is there a smarter way to do this? Um, I don't know. Let's make things up as they go. I actually have to use the button. So I get an opportunity to go into here. I have not even used the light bridge yet. Um, maybe it's the light bridge, like I have the cube on top of the light bridge. Um, I feel like the opposite causality would also probably be handy. Okay, okay what do I do with this cube? <laughs> it's kind of just sitting there. I might also pass through number three and number four on like a different, on the different area. So. But I don't even have the laser in this one, right? I'm able to shoot the time portal. Yeah, but I can't, it's the same time portal. Like, I can't do that and then also do through here. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just kind of aimlessly walking around, so I'm trying to think of a better plan. So how do I hit that three? Um, funny business with the light bridge, probably. There isn't even a light bridge in this version. No, oh my god. Um, okay, so that definitely proves that I need to be in like, different areas somehow. <laughs> Let's get back to there. 
Okay, no, I can just place this portal, you know. It's almost like I have a portal I can place. Anywhere that I want. I'm trying to think of how I can redirect straight into a time portal. Like so. But is that even useful? Probably not. Um, yeah, okay, so this is where it lines up. I'm able to bring this into the main area, which I don't know if I can. Are there portal surfaces facing each other? I don't actually know. Um, besides really high up ones, I don't think so. But like, who let a high up portal surface though? Alright, I can do this. Can I pass through one and two in this side? Uh, Where did the other cube? It's over there. Okay. Um, one is kind of tricky because it's like sunk into the ground in kind of an odd way. So unless I pass the laser for the time portal, which seems kind of like a waste of time, um, I don't think I can pass one and through on the dilapidated side. Let me try it though. Let me just try it. So I can pass the laser through time portal like this. There actually are dual and portal surfaces. And I would think it's going to be in two spots at once, right? I can't bring this one through. Like, I'm not even gonna try it. I will. This will be fun. I haven't done that in a while. So, what I'm thinking about is is it possible to pass through one and two on this side in the future? And I don't know. Because when I do it in the present, it's not that hard. All I have to do is take this cube. I'm doing it too early. Um, something like that. Something like this. I should do that. And like, right there. there we go. It's now actually in the spot where I can kind of see it. Um, but that's definitely like, you know, maybe I can get the cube up here, but no, I can't. It's temporal only. So it's kind of a tacky thing, not sure. Um, how do I even get close to hitting the tree? Like, maybe I... I can't direct laser through the time portal. I've been over that like five times to myself. Just not seeing it. Then when I get through number three and four, it's like, yeah, okay. Well, let's take a slow. So that's how I can get the light bridge through. There we go. I 
have to be a little careful with the ordering. Um, but now I have to go fix my portals, right? Or it's just the portal. Hello. That's a little janky. Is it too low? Oh, it's actually intentionally too low. What's up with that? I thought it was different in the... That's much too low there as well. Huh. I thought that was lined up. So that just raises even more questions about how on earth do I hit this thing if not even the light bridge lines up with it. Uh, do I trap against the light bridge? Using the funnel, push it upwards. I did notice that, I mean, it's, it is lined up like this. Well, I probably need about 15 portals to do that, right? Um, maybe the portal... Um, yeah. Starting to come together, starting to come together. Let's instead put the time portal high up. And I'll bring this cube through. Well, okay, it's a bit early to bring my cube through because I haven't positioned every cube yet. Oh, okay, and I only have one chance. So I don't know which one goes where, so I'm just going to default to putting this cube here. That seems like the cube that's um, yeah whatever. So now let's pass up here. Right, I only get one chance to do this. Um, take this, and the time goes there. Now I take this with me. Line this up. So I'm kind of getting that idea, I think. One, two. Um, right. Let's do this, but quick. There we go. Ooh, I almost had it, actually. Um, I put this portal on the wrong side. Cool, that's number three. And number four is just moving the time portal. And now I just have to get a single cube up here, which is probably harder than it seems. Yeah, it's all the way over there. Ah! It's the surface. Right. Wait, so that means it's actually trivial, right? Um. And then just wait for this really slow funnel. So 
So I don't actually think this doesn't actually get used, right? I kind of wanted to there, but. Right. <laughs> right, yeah. Okay, yeah. I did not see that connection. Well, now it's not too hard to get, right? Um, I just put this one here. And then take it. And then just kind of... Chuck that one into place. I think I can just push it around with the funnel, right? Um, yeah, that's a pretty shallow step, so I think I can just push it over. Yep, that works just fine. I don't know why the funnel is so slow, though. A few other areas of the game have recognized that I'm about to win. Why can't this one? <laughs> I saw that. Astonishing. You really did it. You've proven to be capable of nearly anything. Now it's time for your real mission. Is it one of these? Here's another very slow funnel. We will put you back in stasis until the day of the incident. And you will be the one to prevent it. Huh. This vacuum tube will take you back to the long-term human storage vault. You will be awoken when the time comes to use your special abilities to save this facility from its impending doom. I have a choice. Bye-bye. Morning. You are going the wrong way. Please be aware that escaping is not an option here. You are far too important. Uh -huh. If you won't go voluntarily, we will be forced to destroy your current body in order to put you back together in the stasis chamber. But this will be a small price to pay in order to help save the facility. Think of it as a sacrifice to science. Thank you, and goodbye. Am I supposed to wiggle on the phone? There's not enough time! <laughs> So I will instead do this. Warning. You are deviating from your path. Oh. Facility power has reached critical levels. Has it? Connection unstable. Oh. An elevator. My crosshair is gone. Things are happening. Oh. An ending sequence. Uh-oh. <laughs> there we go. I think that's it. Well, gee. Oh, look, demons are playtesting. That's cool. Not 
recognizing too many of these other names. No, the other ones. <laughs> yeah, that's Harry the voice actor for every single Portal 2 thing ever. That was a very good, that was a very good mod. I went in expecting nothing, because like, oh my god, I've seen Portal 2 time travel before, and it just absolutely blew me away. <laughs> um, yeah, highly recommended. Um, I don't really know what, I feel like I have something to say about it, but I, something else to say about it, but I don't remember what it is, so I guess I'll just leave it at that. Um, that was Portal Reloaded, um, played by me. You're welcome. You're welcome for playing. Let's see. Yep, all 12. Well, I don't really know how to end videos. That's not ever changed, so, uh, see you around.